All right, you guys, welcome back to class. I do apologize for that. I uh, came back and I was sitting down trying to get uh, get back into Hangouts, and it was not opening for me. Uh, I don't know why every once in a while it just decides to freak out and not uh, not think that I'm cool enough to be in uh, in Hangouts. So uh, anyway, uh, last hour was really awesome. We worked a lot on our V sounds with our uh, W sounds. Okay, uh, so now uh, we are going to be working on the V sound versus the B sound. Now, I know uh, um, for a lot of uh, Latin folks, um, it is a difficult sound to produce. So that's why we are practicing it, okay? And so um, I had a lot of people asking me for uh, for certain pronunciations, uh, certain uh, vowels, and I had um, one of my students specifically uh, uh, ask for these these two types of, uh, of pronunciations. I was like, hey, that sounds like a great class. So uh, I decided to put it together, and uh, today that's what we are working on. So <clears throat> let's see who we got in, who we have in class so far. Uh, we have Sergio. How you doing, Sergio? Sergio, can you hear me? Okay. Oh, one second. All right, no worries. Uh, how about uh, how about Omar? <clears throat> Not so much. How about uh, Marcia? How are you? Hey, sorry. Hi. I'm there fine. we go. Hi. Excellent. How's that? Uh, how's everything going? Nice, but my pronunciation is. Already terrible. No, it is still <laughs> terrible, and I need to practice. Oh, great! Well, that, that's a good thing that you're here in Verbling then, because that's what we're about to do. How's uh, how's it? How's your family doing? Very well. My, my, it's a holiday this week. This week, in the next one, uh -huh. will be uh, school holidays here. <clears throat> Okay, so your your son is not in school right now, right? No, he's um, in front of okay. the computer all day. <laughs> <laughs> all right, and uh, and are you uh, uh, are you guys planning on doing anything uh, for the this uh, vacation? Or are you uh, gonna keep it low key and, and stay at home? Um, low key. <laughs> Uh, it's uh, too, right. too cold to 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 go out. To do it, to, okay. To do anything else? Uh, to do anything, anything else. Okay. All right. Yeah, we may we may stay home. We may go someplace. I don't know. We're still we're still undecided. <laughs> um, so we'll see how it goes. Anyway, welcome back to class. It's good to have you here. Thank you. All right. Let's see um, now. Uh, I do apologize, but I do not know how to uh, uh, read that uh, that alphabet. Can you tell me what your name is? You have a uh, a, a lovely yellow shirt on with uh, glasses, but uh, okay. She did not want me to know her name. That's that's okay. Maybe next time. Uh, how about uh, Sergio? How you doing, man? Hi, Chad. How are you? I'm doing well. I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. How's uh, how's work going for you? Everything good? Good, good, good very good. Uh, I just arrived uh, from uh, business travel, but everything okay. Good. Where did where did you go for travel? Sorry. Uh, where did where did you travel to? Ah, uh, I I went to a, a city near Recife called Fortaleza. Okay, and that and that was for business, right? Yeah, definitely for business. I'm okay. very tired, All right. but I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Well, good. Uh, welcome, welcome back to class. It's good to have you here. Uh, let's go to Omar. Omar, did you get your microphone working? Hi. <coughs> Hi there. Hi. How you doing, Omar? Hi. Hi. And uh, Omar, uh, where are you from? I'm from Mexico. 
from Mexico. Excellent. Yes. And uh, Omar, what do you do for work? Uh, I'm sorry? Uh, what do you do for work? I'm a student. Ah, nice. And uh, what do you study? Yes. Uh, yes, what do you study? Uh, I'm studying English. Okay. And uh, are you studying uh, anything else or uh, or are you uh, studying English to be an English teacher? Uh, I'm studying English at the, my house. Okay, excellent. Well, thank you. Thank you very much, Omar. Yes. It's good to have you here. Let's go to uh, Lorenzo. How are you? Fine, and you? I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. And uh, how's how's everything going in, in uh, with life, with uh, with work, with school, with whatever you got going on? I'm teaching all the day. Teaching all day long, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, I, you're, me and you are in the same boat. I te I usually teach all day long. I usually teach about three three blocks uh, in the morning afternoon this is my afternoon block and then I teach a late night block uh, but yeah that's what uh, uh, that's what I end up doing how, how many hours a day do you teach well I teach uh, I teach IT in my college uh, uh -huh. in, in, at the morning and afternoon but uh, okay. the rest of the afternoon I I teach uh, music oh very cool what uh, what kind of music do you teach uh, well, I play drums, percussion. Uh huh. Uh, so, you, do you teach? Uh, um, do you teach uh, children, or do you teach adults and whatnot how to play the drums? Children, elementary level. Level. Okay. Awesome, man. Very cool. Drums are uh, drums are a very fun uh, instrument to play. Yes. <laughs> awesome, man. Very cool. All right. Well, welcome. Uh, welcome back to class. Good to see you again. And we also have Juan here. Juan, how you doing? I'm doing well, teacher. What about you? Good. I'm doing good. It's a little, a uh, little warm here, but I uh, can't complain. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm just glad it's not snowing. That's what, that's what I'm happy for. Well, I could complain, but I won't, teacher. What now? What can you complain about, Juan? Oh, teacher. In Mexico, you can complain about everything if you want. <laughs> or just or, or, or just green and bear it. So it's up to you. <laughs> All right. What the, what uh, what have you done today? What's uh, what's going on? No, I'm just um, just saying. Just woke up and this is the first English class I'm taking today. And I've been studying English, watching some movies that I bought a few days ago. I went to. Um, uh, Calexico, it's a small city that belongs to California, attached to Mexicali. Went there and bought a few mu a, a few movies, and I'm watching them. And this is my very first class of today. Cool. It's a regular cool. day. Yeah, I didn't know. Uh, I didn't know that there that uh, California had uh, uh, you know owned a part of uh, um, Mexicali. So it's it's called uh, what's it called again? Calexico. Calexico. Hmm. Yes, it's pretty much the border with Mexicali. Calexico belongs to the United States. So hmm. people hmm. in Mexicali, most people in Mexicali have a have a visa. You can cross the border, buy a few things there, and if you live in Mexico, you return to Mexico. Wow. That's the way it's, it is. How, how big of a city is it? Calexico? Yeah. No, it's a small town, a very, very small town. Huh. Oh, oh, but you're saying yes, most people small that town. live in... Uh, but you said that in most Mexicali, people that live in Mexicali. To, uh, yes, ah, most gotcha. people that live in Mexicali, okay. when they want I was to buy... Getting, I was getting uh, confused. Oh, okay, okay. I got it. Yes. Yeah, yeah. I, I, thought, I thought you were saying that uh, most people that live in Calexico uh, have a visa, but you had said Mexicali. I, I had understood you wrong. Ah, huh, very cool. Very cool. Well, awesome, man. People from Calexico, people from Calexico go uh, come here to Mexicali to have fun, to in bars, you know, to play uh -huh. pool and all that. But for example, if if we want to buy different groceries, we go to Calexico. 
for example. Huh, interesting. All right, well, cool. Thank you for sharing. Awesome, and that good to have you back in class, man. All right, let's go Thank to... You too, teacher. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let's go to Farhad. How are you? <laughs> I'm doing well, teacher. What's about you? I'm doing quite well. Thank you for asking. Now, uh, this picture is very interesting. Where is this picture from? Uh, this is, I think that uh, this is a place in Australia. Oh, okay. Yeah, it looks, yeah. Uh, it looks uh, really wonderful. It really does. Yeah, 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 yeah. But, uh, but I just, uh, I, 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 I have downloaded it from the internet and I just make them in my profile picture because it looks uh, very uh, uh, charming. I mean that they were really beautiful. Sure, definitely. Now, uh, uh, Farhad, uh, were you in my class earlier today? I believe you're from uh, Pakistan, are you not? Yeah, yeah, I'm from Pakistan, okay. but uh, due to the, uh, uh, I lost, uh, uh, I didn't uh, attend your uh, last class because of the electricity. Uh, the electricity has gone, so that's why I didn't attend uh -huh. your last class. I'm, I'm very worried because I'm trying uh, uh, okay. every, uh, okay. So I mean, I'm trying to pronounce uh, to improve my pronunciation because my pronunciation is not so uh, good. But uh, okay, so uh, at the end of the, this class, please give me some link about the pronunciation so that uh, I can improve my pronunciation. Please, uh, teacher, help me. Okay, sure. Yeah, I have uh, I have some links that we'll go over today. Uh, this hour, we're going to be talking about the V sound versus the B sound. Um, but I can give you the link uh, that we worked on for the V versus the W sound. Okay. Uh, okay. But uh, anyway, welcome back to class. It's good to have you here, man. Uh, all right. Let's see. We also have uh, Charlie. And Charlie, how are you? <laughs> Hello, Ted. How are you today? I'm doing quite well. Now, Charlie. I don't know if I've actually had you in my class before. Have you been with me? I know you're in last class, yes, but uh, uh, before, before I was today. The, I was in the last class. Uh huh. Yeah, I remember that one. But had you, been, had you been in a class before? Had, yes. had you been in, had you been in uh, any one of uh, my classes before? Yeah, the last uh, class. Okay. All right. Very good. And uh, and Charlie, where are you from? I'm from Ecuador. From Ecuador. Okay. Very good. Yes. Well, welcome, <laughs> welcome to class. It's good to have you here. And uh, uh, what uh, what do you do in uh, in Ecuador? What uh, do you work full time, or are you a student? Okay. Now I'm, uh, now I'm living in Spain, <laughs> and I'm studying at the university. Okay. And what are you studying uh, there? Uh, I'm learning uh, a curry, a college philology. philology. Do you uh, know? Te technology, okay. No, 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 no. Uh, well, uh, I learn literatura, literatura. Lit literature. <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah, that's, history, it's called literature. Okay. History. Um, grammatic and all about the Arabic language. Okay, awesome. Uh, that sounds that sounds great. Um, I uh, I wish you well, and I hope uh, I hope everything goes well in the university for you. Thank you. So all right. Much. <laughs> let's uh, let's see who else we have. We also have Ash. Now, Ash, how are you? I'm um, good, man. How are you? I'm doing great, man. Thank you for asking. Uh, Ash, where are you from? I'm currently in Istanbul, Turkey. All right, nice. And uh, and where where are you originally from? Um, well, I'm actually from Istanbul, Turkey, but lived in Australia for about eleven years. Wow, wow! What took you over to Australia? Uh, to study initially, actually, I studied in uh -huh. university there, and I uh, stayed there, and now I'm, I'm in Turkey for sort of for about a year, actually. For okay. Hopefully, going back in about a couple of months. Nice. That'd be cool. And uh, and uh, um, what uh, what kind of a job were you doing there in uh, in Australia? Oh uh, well, I was a um, 
uh, quite funny actually. I was sort of a teacher. I was an educational uh, advisor when I was in Australia. Uh -huh. I was uh, making like a uh, the career guidance for students in high school and primary school. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. Very cool. Good for you. Yeah. There's uh, they they do a lot of that in the in the United States as well, where they have a uh, a guidance counselor that kind of. Um, helps uh, help students figure out what they're going to do make sure they're making the, the right choices uh, uh, based on their um, you know their scolecular achievements and whatnot uh, so that they're completing their classes and they're and they're getting them pointed in the right direction so awesome very cool job that's right yeah 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 man. it's challenging actually because it's a very laid-back country you know and wow. uh, like countries such as like Asian countries especially the education is so important that people are especially families actually put a lot of attention on it but countries such as Australia because people are so laid back some professional has to step in and give them some sort of guidance otherwise you know not, not, none of the kids want to study no you know you just have to make them so we're the people who are making them yeah definitely all right well cool welcome uh, welcome to class good to have you here you uh, let's much. go to uh, Amparo how are you here again Yes, you are. <laughs> Pronunciation is an issue that I am. I need to improve. <laughs> yeah, you did very well last uh, last hour with the with the V and the W sound. Um, mm. Now, how do you, how do you feel confident with the uh, V and the B sound? Better, yes. Okay. All right. Very good. All right. Yeah. So we're we're uh, we're going to attack this from uh, more of the uh, uh, the Latin side of it with that B sound. Um, mm -hmm. uh, I want I I went the uh, W route uh, during the day because we have a lot, uh, or earlier in the day because we have a lot of uh, um, you know people from uh, the eastern side of of the world. And I wanted to I wanted to do this one a little bit later in the afternoon because. Uh, mm -hmm. People will start getting out of work and things like that, and they may want to try it. Uh, I'll uh, I'll see if I can do uh, do the V sound uh, another time. I only have time today to do uh, uh, the VW sound one more time, and I'm going to do that later at night. But uh, yeah, we'll see we'll see how everything goes. So uh, welcome back to class. I'm Fado. Good to good to have you here. All right, you guys. Um, yes, did you have a question? Okay, cool. So. Uh, for those of you who do not know who I am, uh, I am uh, Chad. You can call me Teacher Chad or just Teacher. Uh, this hour, we are going to be focusing on our pronunciations, okay? Uh, mainly focusing on the V sound, right? Um, and we're comparing it against the B sound. Uh, a lot of times, the V is confused with the W, with the B, with the F. Okay, it's a it's a particularly hard sound to uh, to recreate, uh, but with practice you will be able to say it properly. Okay, so this hour that's a, that's what we're going to be focusing on. Uh, let me go ahead and open up the the links that we are going to be working on first. Um, we're going to be working on minimal pairs first off. Okay, and talking Again, the, about the, the uh, chat is not working, uh, teacher. Uh, your verbling chat isn't working? Well, I've been trying to share some uh, comments and it doesn't allow me to do that. So uh, I, yeah. I wanted to share with you a photo uh, at the border with Calexico and I had to do it with the Google chat instead of verbling chat. Yeah, I just uh, I just tried to uh, uh, type something into a verbling chat as well and it's not working. So. Uh, let's uh, let everybody. Let's have you switch over to um, Google Chat. Okay, if uh, that's where I'm going to be uh, typing in messages. Mm -hmm. All right. This here is. Uh, let me give you. Let me give you the minimal pairs link that we're going to be working on. All right, and I just opened up the uh, that picture that you sent me one okay so okay. the uh, minimal pairs when you open it up this is what it's going to look like okay uh, we're going to talk a little bit about how to pronounce the V and the B sound okay and uh, and then uh, go through some uh, uh, some words just kind of like how we did with our uh, with the uh, the V and the W and then we'll get into some tongue twisters okay all right so uh, first up uh, let me uh, let me start over on the right hand side this hour. I'll start with uh, Sergio. 
And Sergio, can I have you read? Um, let me have you read where it says uh, English. Okay, so the uh, English club tip um, down to, so uh, English club tip to English t club tip. So that information right in between here, okay? Go ahead and read that, please. Okay. Uh, well, let me just to, oh. okay. English club tip. This page, this page uses the symbols of the phonetic chart. You can listen to the symbol here. B has the same mouth position as P, but using your voice. Try saying P and then hold your neck to make sure that your voice is being used when you say B. There should be a sudden release of air as you say the sound. Mean meaning uh, that is, it is po impossible to withstand it. V has the same mouth shape as F, but using your voice, put your top teeth on your bottom, bottom lip. It is possible to withstand the sound for as long as you like. Okay, good, good. So. Uh, what they're what they're talking about here when they're talking about extending a sound. All right. So when I say B, I can't say B, 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 B. that 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 wouldn't make that sound. Okay, that would be more of a bubbling sound. All right. So we can't extend that sound. B is a quick sound. B. Okay. So let's uh, we're going to practice the word bat. Okay. Remember, we put our lips together. We say B, bat, bat. All right, this is a simple word. Let me have everybody try this word. Okay, Ambato, uh, please say the word bat for me. Bat. Okay, good. And Charlie, please uh, say the word bat. Bat. Good. All right, uh, Farhad, bat. 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 Good. Good. Juan, bat. Bat. Good. Okay. Lorenzo, bat. Bat. Good. Nice job. Uh, Marcia, bat. Bat. All right. Good. Omar, bat. Bat. Excellent. And we'll go to Sergio, bat. Bat. Good. All right. So uh, let me have everybody mute your microphones. We've got like uh, an ice cream truck sound, a lot of wind coming through something. So let's let's make sure that we can uh, uh, mute our uh, our microphones so that we don't have as much background noise. Okay. All right, you guys. Okay. So good. So remember, bat. We are, our lips are together now, and, and and it's a quick sound. That, on the other hand, is a V sound and it's a vibration. So our lip, our lips and our teeth, our our lip and our teeth are going to make a vibration. Okay, really quick, and we can hold that sound out. Okay, so the difference would be, okay. So we're going to practice the word that. Okay, it's very similar, but we're going to say that. So I want you to hold that V for just a little bit and then say at. Okay, that. Okay, Omar, please mute your microphone. That. All right, Omar, please mute your microphone until it's your turn, okay? Okay. All right, so thank you. All right, so Amparo, let me have you practice the word that. That. Good. Okay, Charlie, that. That. Excellent. Uh, Amar, that. That. Good. One more time. That. Va. Okay. We, instead of saying va, vat, we want to use an a sound. Va, vat. Va. Okay. All right. Uh, how about uh, Farhad? Farhad. Uh, vat. Uh, yeah. Vat. Good. One more time. V. Vat. V. V. Vat. Okay. Good. Getting much better. Okay. Let's go to Juan. Vat. Vat. Okay, one more time. V that. 
that. Perfect. Nice job. Okay. Lorenzo, that. That. Good. Nice job. Marcia, that. That. Okay. One more time. V that. That. Good. Okay. So, as I as I'm uh, uh, as I was looking at looking at your lips a little bit. Okay. As you as you were pronouncing it, um, <clears throat> uh, the V sound. Uh, you want you don't want as much press pressure. Okay. With the F. We we put a little pressure on our on our lips and we don't let uh, a, a lot of air come through and that's why that's why it makes that sound because the, the air is forcing its way through, okay. But with the V, we place so let's say this is our, our lip our bottom lip and these are our teeth. We place them very lightly, okay, so that the vibration can take place, okay. So let's practice that V sound. We're gonna say, try that. Okay, Marcia, try try that sound with me, okay? Try. Okay, you're almost there. You're almost there. Okay, so you don't you don't want to you don't want to take out your lip. Okay, keep your lip and your teeth in the same place. We're gonna say. Yeah. Okay. So hold your teeth and your lips in that same spot. Okay. Good. All right. So now we're gonna we're gonna separate the word. We're gonna say at. At. Okay. Good. Let's bring it a little closer. At. At. Okay. At. Now let's extend that V a little bit. We're gonna say that. At. That. There you go. That. That. Good. Okay, so that's how you would pronounce that, okay? All right, very good. Let's go to Omar. Omar, uh, say the word fat for me. That. Good. One more time. That. That. Good. Nice that. job. Nice job. Okay, how about you, Sergio? The word is that. That. Okay, one more time. That. That. Good, good, nice job. Okay, all right, class. So we practice the B and the V sound. Now we're gonna we're gonna step it up a notch. Okay, and we're gonna practice some words that are closely related in spelling. Okay, so they have the same vowel sounds. Okay, the only difference is going to be that B and the V sound. Okay, okay. so uh, let's go to. Let's go back to our uh, our uh, um, link, that first link that I that I gave you, and we're going to go to um, let's go to uh, intermediate and upper intermediate first, okay? And we'll see how much time we have left, okay? So we're going to say bail, veil, okay? So you see how there's two words right next to each other? All right, we're going to say bail, veil, bars, base. Or vase or vase, okay. It's actually uh, vase, okay. Vaz. Bent, vent, Vaz. best, Vaz. vest, bet, vet, okay. And then come down to upper intermediate, bane, vein, brewery, mm -hmm. very, bow, mm -hmm. vow, lobs, bow. okay. So lobs and loaves are sorry. Mm -hmm. Sorry, this is lobes and loaves and rebel and revel. Okay, so this yeah. is the list. We're going to go from intermediate to yeah. upper intermediate. Okay, uh, let's let's uh, let's start with Sergio. Sergio, let me have you read those words that are in between intermediate to upper intermediate. Okay. Sergio, are you there? Hi, Chad. Hi. Yeah. yeah, let me have you read the words that are in between intermediate to upper intermediate. So these words that I've just highlighted, okay? So uh, right next to each other, we have bail and veil, okay? So I want you to read through yeah. this, this list, okay? Yeah. Intermediate and upper. Yeah. Okay. okay, try that out. Go for it. Uh, 
Bell, Vel, Bars, Vers, okay. Band, Vent, Burst, Burst, Bat, Vat. Okay, now the, those two, instead of an A ah sound, we're going to say be, Bet, and Vet. Bat, Vat. Okay, good. All right. Keep going down into upper intermediate. Okay. Ben, Ven. Very, very. Good. Ball, Vol. Mm -hmm. Love, Love. Okay, so let's try this one here. It's Lobes, Loaves. Lobes. Lobes. Okay, try that one more time. We're going to say lobes with a B and loaves with a V. Okay. Lobes. Lobes. There you go. Good. Okay. And the last two, please. Rebel. Revel. Good. Nice job. Okay. Uh, Omar, your turn, please. Uh, yes. Bell. Bell. Boo. Boo. All right, let's uh, let's practice these, okay? So first off, we have bail and veil. Okay. Bell, bell. Okay. Ball, vey. Ben, ven. Uh huh. Bet, vet. Bet, vet. And upper intermediate as well. So we have uh, five more pairs. Okay. Bang, bang. Mm -hmm. Berry, berry. All right, let's try those. So we're going to say berry and v very. Okay. Berry, very. Okay, good. Bow, bow. Love, look. All right, let's try these these words here. It's okay. lobes, lobes with the B, and then loaves, loaves. Okay. Love, love. Good. R okay. The next river, word, please. River. Okay. This is rebel and revel. Okay. Rebel and revel. Good. Good. Nice job. All right. So, Marcia, are, are you uh, on your way back? Maybe not. Let's go to Lorenzo. Let me have you read those words, please. Bail, veil. Bars, vas. Bent, vent. Best, vest. Bet, vet. Bain, vein. Very, very. Bow, vow. Lobes, loaves. Ribble, rivel. Good, excellent job, excellent. Okay, uh, Juan, your turn, please. Okay, uh, let's see. Let's go back to uh, Marcia. Marcia, let me have you uh, practice those words. Okay, so starting at intermediate. Intermediate. Okay. Um. Uh, bail, veil, bars, vase, bent, faint, best, vest, bet, vet. Good. Okay, and upper intermediate as well. You're doing good. You're doing good. Bain, vein, very, very, bow. Vo, lobes, le loaves, rebel, revel. Okay, so that's going to be rebel and revel. Revel. Revel, revel. Okay, give me one more time. Rev with that V sound. Rev, revel. Revel. Good, revel. good. All right, I also want to practice uh, bow. So this is bow and vow. 
Bow. Bow. Good. Excellent job. Okay, you did very well with those words. Nice job, Marcia. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Yeah, yeah. I can tell. I can tell you concentrating. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, let's go to Juan. Juan, let me have you read those words, please. Or do you want to try the advanced words, Juan? Uh, it's it's up to you, teacher. You're in the driver's seat. All right, whichever ones you want to do. Um, let's. Uh, uh, do you want Do you want to do uh, the intermediate or the advanced, Juan? Okay, advanced will be fine. Okay, go for it, man. Okay, advanced proficiency, right? Yep. Okay, it says, veil, veil, vein, vein, vat, vat, beer, veer, vent, vent, beat, beat, vial, vial, vis, vis, bolt, vault, vowels, vowels, good, bowl, bowl, broom, vroom, all right, verbs, verbs. Okay, just till there. Nice job. Good job. The one of the hardest ones is vowels and vowels. Okay, I can't tell you how many times I've heard the word bowels uh, when when uh, when someone has said bowels. Okay, and I was like, you, bow, wait, because bowels uh, bowels are like the inside and around, you know, in your kind of your private area. That those are your bowels, right? Um, and uh, and uh, they would say bowels. It's uh, it's the second bowel in my name. What do you mean? <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> very good job, nice job. Okay, let's go to Farhad. And Farhan, yeah. let me, let's go to the, the intermediate to upper intermediate, okay? So go ahead and start with this one right here. Bail and veil. Okay, uh, wait a minute. Bail, veil. Van, van. Bed, vet. Beer, beer. Bent, vent. Bet, Red, vile, vile, well, um, bez, res. Okay, let's try that one, one more time. Let me try that. Let's let me have you try that one one more time. You're doing really good with your V sounds. Okay, all right. Now this one is a little difficult because we have the Z. Okay, so we say biz, biz. biz. Try that. Okay, biz, vez. Good. Uh, bolt, walt. Okay, let's try that. Okay, we're gonna say bolt and v volt. V bolt, volt. Good. Next one. B balls, wow, walls. All right, let's try this. Uh, one, okay, this is v v ow v vowels. Okay, vowels, vowels, vowels. Vowels okay. and vowels. Vowels, vowels. Okay, one Vowel. more time. V vowels. Vowels. Good, nice vowels. job. Okay. Ball, wall. Room, 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 room. Good, yes. Room. But, okay. Okay, broom, room, broom. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Verbs, verbs. Okay. Verbs. Uh, all right, just tell right there. All right, that last word is ver, verbs. V verbs. Okay. Verbs. Ver. Verbs. V ver, ver. 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 Okay. Uh, verbs. Verbs. Okay. All right. Okay. Good, good job. And Farhad, you uh, you tried the uh, advanced words and you did fairly well at those. Good job. Okay. Let's go to uh, okay. uh, Amar. Uh, now, Amar, do you want to uh, try the uh, um, intermediate to upper intermediate words or some advanced words? What would you like to do? Word, word, words, words, then. Ven, 
wit, 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 wit. Okay, so let's uh, let's stop it right there. Okay, you're doing very well. Your B's and V's, I can hear the difference. Okay, but we need to work on the vowel sounds that follow. Okay, and the other consonants. All right. So for example, let's try out these this fir these first two words. This is bail and veil. Try that. Veil and veil. Okay, bail, veil. Veil, veil. Okay, how about bars and vas? Bars and but. Good. Okay, this word, this these words are bent with a T sound, bent and vent. Bent is ven. Okay, one more time. Bent, vent. Bent, ven. Okay, so this first word is b, bent. Ben. Okay, let's uh, let's try that one more time. So we're going to split that word up. We're going to say be, be bent, bent, bent. Okay, bent, bent. Okay, be, bent, bent. Okay, all right. The next word is v, vent, vent, vent. Okay, one more time, vent, vent. Okay, it sounds like that T sound may be a little bit challenging for you at the end. But you're doing good. Your B's and V's are doing okay, all right? All right, let's try a couple more, and then and then I'm going to move on, okay? So let's go to uh, this next word. This is best and vest. Best, what? Okay, B, best, best. But, but. Okay, and then we're going to say V. Vest. 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 Okay. All right. Little difficult. Let's try. Let's try a little bit easier one. We're gonna say be, bet, and vet. 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 Okay. A little bit easier. One more time. Bet. Vet. 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 Okay. Getting. Getting closer. Getting closer. All right. Very good. Nice job, Amar. Nice okay. job. And uh, Amar, where are you from? Uh, I am from Cali, Colombia. Cali, Colombia. Okay, good. Awesome. Welcome to class. Good to yeah. have you here. Uh, okay. Now, Charlie, Charlie, let me have you practice the uh, intermediate and the upper intermediate words, please. Okay. Uh, veil, veil, mm -hmm. verse, vase, mm -hmm. ven, bent, or bent. So it's bent and vent. Okay, uh, bent, vent. Good. This, this, bed, vet, bang, vein, very, very. Good. There. Um, bow, bow, mm -hmm. load, load. Good. Good. Just till there. Excellent job. Your V's and your B's are sounding very good. Thank you, Charlie. And uh, how about uh, Amparo? Uh, let me have you practice uh, the intermediate to upper and intermediate words, please. Or you can practice the advanced if you want, Amparo. Let me try. Okay. Veil, veil. Vein, vein. Bat, bat. Here. Beer, then, then, feed, feed, file, file, feed, feed, ball, ball, vowel, vowel, hi, ball, ball, broom, broom, verb, verb. Good. All right. Try that last word one more time. Verbs, verbs. Ver, ver. All right, good, good. Okay, excellent job, you guys. Okay, so what I want to do now is uh, is practice some. Uh, we've got about ten minutes left, and I want to practice some tongue twisters. Now, uh, Hangouts is uh, dragging my system uh, pretty good right now, so it's going to take me just one second. Let's go ahead and go to. 
that second link that I have, which is called Tongue Twisters for B versus V. All right, and it is taking its time. All right, cool. So if you uh, if you do not have the link, I'm going to put it in. Okay, thank you, Marcia. Very good. Okay, so if you do not have the link, Marcia just put it in the uh, in the uh, in the chat box. Okay, uh, just remember, everybody, uh, uh, mute your microphones, mute your microphones, because uh, some of you have uh, some noises that are going on uh, behind you. Okay. All right, just so that we can keep a uh, keep it a little bit more quiet here. All right, and when we uh, when we open this up, go ahead and open that uh, that tongue twisters page. Uh, when you open it up, this is what it's going to look like. Oh come on! Okay, here we go. All right, so um, this is what it's going to look like, and we're going to scroll down. And we've got uh, we've got a fair number of them, maybe maybe about eight of these. Uh, so we'll uh, we'll work on we'll work on some of these together. Let's start off with uh, Sergio over on the right hand side. And uh, Sergio, uh, let me have you read this uh, this first one that's uh, that's at the top of the list here. It says, "Betty loves the velvet vest best." Okay. Um, Barry loves the felt felt first breast. Okay, let's try it one more time. All right, we're gonna say, yeah, it's difficult. It's difficult. So slow it down just a little bit. We're gonna say, Betty loves the velvet vest best. Okay. Barry Barry loves loves the velvet vest best. There you go. Nice job. Good, good. Okay, let's go to uh, uh, Omar. Omar, let me yep. have you read uh, the second one here. It uh, it is. I'm very bad at volleyball, but very fine at basketball. I'm very bad at volleyball, but very fine at basketball. Okay, good, good. Nice job. Um, all right, let's. Uh, very loves the velvet vest best. Okay, who's who's talking? Uh, make sure that you don't talk until, unless I uh, call on you. Okay, all right. Uh, let's go to Marcia. Uh, Marcia, let me have you. We're gonna go to the V sounds. This one's gonna this one's gonna challenge you a bit, Marcia. Okay, mm -hmm. this one is uh, right here. Okay, it's okay. a sort of a long one. It has a lot of V's. All right, I'm gonna read it once. Okay, mm -hmm. Vincent, the very vivacious vacuuming vampire. Visited Victor Vaughn, Viking, the vegetarian, vegetarian, oh, whoops, it has vegetarian twice, whoops, the vegetarian vacationing in Va Valentine Valley. Oh, Vincent, the very vivas, vivacious, vacuuming vampire, visited Victor Vaughn, Viking, the vegetarian, Vo va vacationing in the Valentine Valley. Good. All right. One more time. All right. Um, I'll read it one more. Okay. Mm -hmm. Vincent, the very vivacious vacuuming vampire, visited Victor von Viking, the vegetarian, vacationing in Valentine Valley. Vincent, oh, very... oh, I get it. I had messed up. I thought it was vegetarian twice. It is not. This is what uh -huh. <laughs> no. Correct. It is not. Yeah, it's it's vegetarian veterinarian. Veterinarian. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, that's funny. I know, huh? That's funny. Okay, so I, I, I read it, it completely incorrectly. All right, so. All right, so let's try this one more time. Okay, it's Vincent... The very vivacious vacuuming vampire visited Victor von Viking, the vegetarian veterinarian, vacationing in Valentine Valley. Okay, so let's have you try that, okay? Mm-hmm. 
Vincent the very vivacious vacuuming vampire visited Victor van Viking, the vegetarian veterinarian, vac vacationing in Valentine Valley. All right, good, nice job, nice job. Okay, very let's. Uh, yeah, it is. Okay, let's uh, uh, let's go to Lorenzo. Lorenzo, let me have you try that one. Um, we can. Uh, uh, we have two fairly difficult ones here. The one with the uh, V, and then I have one here that's big black bug bit a big black bear, and the big black bear bled black blood. Okay. So, uh, Lorenzo, do you want to try a V sound or a B sound? A B sound. A B, as in uh, basketball. Yes. Okay, B. go ahead. Go ahead and uh, and try any one of these that are under the uh, B sounds. Go for it. The first one. Yeah, sure. Go for it. Betty and Bob brought back blue balloons from the big bazaar. Good, big balloon or blue balloons from the big blue. bazaar. Back blue balloons from the big bazaar. Good, nice job. Good job with your B sounds. Uh, let's, all right. Okay, um, Omar, Omar, Omar. Okay, Omar, I, I've got, I've got to eject you, buddy. I apologize. All right, so let's go to Juan. Yes, it's all right, Juan. Uh, which uh, which one do you want to work on? A V sound or a B sound? Mm, the V sound. B as in boy. Okay, B as in boy. All right, go for it. Choose any one of those that are under the uh, B sound. Okay, the big black. Okay. Okay, go for it. Big black bug bit a big black bear. And the big black beer bled black blood. <laughs> nice, good. One, one more time, Juan. Yes, it says big black bug beat a big black beer, and the big black beer bled black blood. Nice, good job. Very good. Okay, and let's see, let's go to uh, Amar. Amar, okay. would you like to practice uh, a V sound or a B sound? B sound. B All right. Sound. Okay, go go B for sound. it. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead and choose one. V sound, the very B, uh, muy, uh, B sound, the very vivation, vacuuming, vampire, beauty, Victor, both became vegetarian. A vegetarian vacationing Valentin Valerie. Okay, so let's uh, let's go ahead and practice that. I'll read it one more time and then I'll have you repeat it, okay? This okay. is a really difficult one, all right? It is Vincent, the very vivacious vacuuming vampire, visited Victor von Viking, the vegetarian veterinarian, vacationing in Valentine Valley. Okay, try that one more time. Vision the very vivation vacuuming vampire the city Victor Bot the king vegetarian vegetarian vacationing in Valentin Valley Valley. All right, very good, very good. Hello, you guys. Can you hear me? Okay. Yes. Hello. Yeah. Uh, can you guys hear me fine? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Yeah, that one is really difficult. Really difficult. Uh, so, nice, nice try on that one. Okay, uh, um, Amar. All right. Let's see who else we got now. Uh, Hangouts is not working properly for me. I can't scroll over the names. I know I have Ambato at the very end, but I can't mm -hmm. see the names of the people Charlie. in the middle. Okay, Charlie. Okay, Charlie, uh, let me have you, uh, uh, do you want to practice a V sound or a B sound? Um, the V sound. 
Okay, go ahead and in, in, in try one out. One second, please. Okay, can you hear me? Uh, yep, I can hear you. Okay, um, Vincent, the very vivacious vacuuming. <laughs> uh oh, there, I've got a lot of different sounds going on. What? Hello. Uh, yes. Uh, go ahead. Go ahead and, and try out that V sound. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, this is the very vivacious vacuuming vampire. He say visited Victor from Viking the vegetarian. What's happening? Okay. A veterinarian vacation. Holy cow. Okay. I don't I don't know who has who has other uh, uh, web uh, another website open. Can you guys hear all the different voices? Yeah, teacher, this is basically the echo. Uh, someone has uh, turned on yeah. the uh, your uh, this uh, uh, um, I mean the language class uh, their verbal uh, man window. I think. Okay. Let me let me have every let me have everybody let me have everybody mute their he's microphones. Trying, trying I do I do apologize. Yeah, there's way way too much sound going on. Uh, we're gonna have to end end the class. I can't figure out who's doing it. What's up? Wow. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with uh, with uh, Hangouts right now. But yeah, I do apologize. I think there's some some uh, like fierce background noise. So I do apologize. But we'll be uh, doing the V sound a little bit later, um, later at night. Uh, thank you guys for for stopping by. I I think this is a uh, uh, a Hangout issue. I don't know exactly what what what's going on. But yeah, I can't hear hardly anything. Um, there was a lot of different uh, um, uh, screens that were open, and I couldn't hear anything. So I do apologize, but uh, yeah, uh, stick with me. We have an, we have another class coming up after this. Okay, all right, guys. See Thanks. You. We'll see ya. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thanks, Shad. Bye bye. Shad, you're a friendly teacher. Thanks.